Hi guys, Michael from Anokyo Blog here, and I'm going to do an app review of Fennec Firefox, um, the nightly build 9.0A1, I believe it is. This is actually a bit of effort to get installed, but and I will post how I did it in the description below. Let me just go to my Nokia blog. So as you can see, you just drag it across, you get a list of your windows, and you can open up new tabs of windows. Drag it to the other side, you get your favorites, navigation between um, previous and next page, settings, about Firefox, you can choose all your different settings, JavaScript, all that sort of stuff. Up here you have downloads, your add-ons, which so far I still haven't been able to get Flash working. Um, force add-ons compatibility that still didn't work because apparently Flash doesn't work with the nightly build. So as you can see, very smooth scrolling. Pinch to zoom works quite well. Um, just do a quick HTML5 test. Sorry, that's a bit blurry. I don't know why my N8 hasn't been autofocusing some videos today. A bit picky and choosy. Um, something I do like, though, is the rotation. You can rotate it one way, like that. You can rotate it to the other side. You can even rotate it upside down, which I think is pretty cool. So as you can see, this version of Firefox gets 314 and 9 bonus points. And this is a mobile version. It's not ported straight over. Well, it is, but it's not a Linux port. It's actually done by Mozilla themselves. Um, let me get a checkerboarding going on there. Let me just zoom in. Wants to let me? No? Anyway. Don't know if you can see that. I can't even really see it myself. Um, but it says 341 is for Chrome, followed up by 313, which is, so that's desktop actually, Firefox 6. Let's have a look at mobile browsers. So it says Opera is currently leading at 269, which, as we just saw, if I go back, into our score, two sixty nine is a lot less than what Fennec is giving you on the N nine and N nine fifty if you're a developer. So, in my opinion, very good web browser. The only thing is that Flash and sometimes does checkerboard, which Opera doesn't actually do, which I like. Um, something that I find quite neat, let me go to YouTube, quite neat in Fennec, is the ability to, if you go to a website, let me just do it this way, for example, um, wait till YouTube loads, up the top corner up here, if you just tap that little box, you can actually add it as a search engine. So now, when I hit here, I can search, let's just go. And you can f scroll up, and you have a YouTube search. Simple as that. Also, if you like having Firefox on your desktop computer, there is an option, if you go into settings, I can find it. To enable sync. So sync, you can sync all your tabs, you can sync your bookmarks, all that sort of stuff, even history, passwords, all of that with um, your desktop, which I think is a pretty cool function and very useful if you have a lot of accounts with varying passwords that you don't remember. Or even if you just find a page that you like and 
because we don't have Nokia drop on here, you want to send the link over, you can just open it up on your phone. So that's Fennec demoed for you guys. Hope you enjoyed the review. Um, post your thoughts in the comments below. If there's anything, like I always say, if there's anything you guys want reviewed, let me know. I'll do my best to get to it. Um, and thanks for watching.